The fourth team in tournament history to advance after trailing in extra time. Are you kidding me? As they knock out the favorites of the World Cup and they do it in grand style in Croatia. The first time team to do this in this fashion since Sweden did it back in 1994. All right. Uh, back here with Taylor. How surprising was this result to you with Brazil being eliminated? I'm surprised, and that, uh, that's not to downgrade anything by which Cro Croatia has accomplished. This is going to be the third appearance in the World Cup semifinals since leaving Yugoslavia in the early 19, uh, 1990s. And so they don't take this for what it's worth. They went to the final in 2018. However, 117th minute, you're up 1-0 off of arguably the greatest team goal in this entire World Cup. This is inexcusable from Brazil. You were the favorite. You were the deepest team, and this cannot happen. This is the same country that lost in the semifinal 7-1 to Germany. So, Kevin, make no mistake about it. This is a huge choke job from Brazil, and Neymar to tie it in that fashion with Pelé and all of those records going down the drain. This is Brazil's tournament to lose, and make no mistake about it. You tip your cap out of respect to Croatia, but Brazil lost the game today. Croatia didn't come back and win that, and that is inexcusable for how much quality they had. Uh, Brazil, by the way, you mentioned it. We talked about it, the favorite to win the World Cup. All tournament, that distinction now belongs to Messi and Argentina as they survive. Taylor, we appreciate you. Thank you so much. A closer look at, after one of the craziest days during the World Cup. Here's where things stand. Croatia and Argentina will meet the semis on Tuesday following the stunning exit from Brazil. Tomorrow, Morocco. How about everybody's fan favorite there taking on Portugal as well as France versus England. That will be another epic showdown. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.